Good evening, everybody, and thank you for joining us. Marissa has the evening off. As lava continues to spread and roll into the ocean on the Big Island, the state is increasing efforts to help marine life. Action spurred in part by social media posts like we've all seen over the past several weeks, including one specifically of a turtle in distress. And a bit of a warning, the video is difficult to watch. As you can see, the turtle apparently struggling in the water as lava flows down in the distance. The Department of Land and Natural Resources has seen the video, but they want the public to know that if you see something like this happening, don't get involved, but let them know about it immediately. Kimberly Speakman with more on efforts to protect the wildlife in the lava zone. The DLNR says that in the last 10 days, they've put together three flyovers of the potential areas where the turtles may have gotten trapped. They say so far, they've been out of luck. And again, we looked carefully for turtles um, along the coastline. Uh, in the, in the vicinity of the approaching lava and didn't see any. She says that lack of visibility is one of their toughest challenges right now, along with volcanic smog and fumes. It's hard to see turtles in the water right now. The water uh, along the coastline is very, very turbid. The water is, you can't, you can't see very far into the water at all. So this is the worst of conditions. Very hard even to see any and in very dangerous conditions for, for humans and wildlife. She says once they are able to identify turtles in need of aid, they will come up with a plan to safely get it out of the area. If you see a turtle in need, the DLNR wants you to report it immediately. We ask people to keep an eye out. If there's something that we can do in current time, please call us right away and we'll try to respond. The number to call is on our website, khon2.com. Kimberly Speakman, KHON 2 News.